I've got a new mission for you, boss. The client is one of the kids you rescued from that mine. According to the kids, people often disappear from the mine to a place called Nzoya Badiabulo, the Devil's House. On top of that, Sainer's involved with the place. Check your iDroid for the mission details. What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Mr. Channel 1, and welcome back to more Metal Gear Solid 5. The Phantom Pain walkthrough. Hopefully you're enjoying it so far. Again, I've been gone for the past few days, but now I'm back from tour, so it is time to continue. Let's go ahead and get some rewards. It's been a, a few days, obviously, since I've played this, so I'm actually really excited to get back uh, into it, of course. Uh, right now, it's... There we go. All right, we're going to go ahead, before I even start, and just go ahead and disconnect. All right. So with that being said, we're gonna go into the next mission here. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, let's do see what we okay, Please we got. Please select a mission. One of those. We got some staff recruitments. We'll go ahead and do one of those. That shouldn't take Unit very long. Dispatched. All right, and we're gonna go into our mission Please list. select a mission. So we are doing mission number twenty, which is voices. Hopefully, you guys will enjoy. And let's listen to the briefing tape. Boss, the client this time is a child. One of the children you rescued from that mine. He wants us to save the boy who was their leader. His name is Shabani, and he was the oldest among them. Several days before you went to the mine, he was taken away to Nzoya Badiabulu. Our search turned up a place the locals call by that name. Ngumba Industrial Zone. Nearby residents are terrified of it. They say the devil lives there. And that anyone who sets foot in it never returns. This industrial zone has long been abandoned, but it seems it was sold off a few years back to a certain corporation, Saner. And now the perimeter is tightly guarded by a PF. The reason is unclear. The same goes for why Shabani was taken away. But something is obviously going on there. Those kids from the mine really looked up to Shabani. The client has given us the last of their diamonds in return. Go get Shabani out of there, boss. Whatever Cypher's up to in the region, Shibani might just be our best lead. Mission accepted. Alright, so let's take a look at the map here and let's see what we got. So obviously heading to the industrial zone. A few places in between there. I can see a a route that would take us that way. So I guess we could go this way. We could go this way, take a route over to here, and then up through here, and then over to there, so okay. All right. Well, I guess we only have one starting point, so let's go ahead and uh, check that. To Central Africa. We're gonna go ahead and start the mission, I guess, with D Horse, since it looks like to be a long trek. Uh, as far as weapons go, I'm going to start equipping a lot more things. Uh, I've never needed hand grenades, so we're gonna start bringing. Uh, So we got a flashbang grenade and combat nearby enemies upon detonation. I gotta figure out where the uh, sleep grenades are. I think we need to develop those. So let's bring that. That's a stun and a smoke, so we're, we'll just bring both. Uh, let's see what else. Alright, so as you can see, you know, we haven't really been using any of these. We've been doing it as stealthily as possible without, but now we're gonna start, obviously, using some of those items. Uh, let's see. Everything else I think we're pretty much good to go with. I like my lineup. Should be fine. Although I do see something that I might want to check out. Developments of weapons. Specify a project. What the heck? Water pistol. Trigger connected to the high capacity water pump launches a controlled stream of water. <laughs> Alright, well, let's get it. Children's reward? Huh. Well, let's get it. Uh, let's see what else we got here. This is our level 2 for this. I suppose we could start to. start leveling it up. We really don't use it that much, so that's why I just haven't been thinking about leveling them up, but I guess we could start doing that since we're going to get into weapons customization here pretty added. soon. Uh, let's see. Bait, bottle, ac active decoy. That's a better decoy. We'll go ahead and get that. Uh, 
Oh, that's right. We have the sneaking suit that we can level up, so we're going to head and do that. We have enough fuel resources. As far as that goes, I think that's going to be about it for right now. Uh, let's take a look at our base management real quick. And we still got 19 minutes, and we'll have an R&D platform, and then we also have a support that we can start getting ready. Uh, which I'm sure will come in handy too, so we'll wait a little bit on that. And without further ado, we're going to go ahead and start. Again, guys, this is mission number 20, Voices. Hopefully you guys will enjoy. And again, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe if you're not already. And of course, I will see you inside. However, I guess we'll go with a... I mean, we are in Africa, I guess, so... It'd be better to use this suit. this one. Alright, I think we're ready. This is mission number 20, Voices Rescue Shabani. And we'll do this during the daytime. Deploying. So we did find a shortcut right here. So we're gonna take that. Marker placed. Let's see, we take this shortcut, cut around the corner, and we keep going to there. Okay. Like I said, it's been a few days, so hopefully uh, I didn't forget any of the awesome moves in this game. We just got back. We did a tour up um, in Owensboro, Kentucky. Uh, we played for an air show up there. It was really cool. We played uh, two different nights. Had some good crowds. And uh, I just love playing music. It's such a passion of mine. And, uh, you know, I get to come home. And now I get to uh, play some more Metal Gear Solid 5 with you guys. So, can't complain. You have arrived at your destination. Looks like we got a guard post, so we'll just Enemy stealth on by. Detected. The map has been updated. Need to stick close to the left side, if I'm not mistaken. Get against the edge, it looks like. Enemy presence detected. They even got a guard post there. Security sure is tight. I guess they don't want anyone poking around. See, we got, ooh, we got an A and a D.
coming too. Roger that. Mist. Supposedly the valley up ahead is covered in mist almost year-round. The objective area is beyond there. Bridge is collapsed. Looks like you'll have to go down through the valley. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. Oh, mist. Look at this. Okay. I still see a way that we can go this way, though. Let's see. Yeah, it looks like we can can't go that way, but we can cut to the right and head up. Okay. Enemy presence detected. All right, we got. Map right. has been updated. So we'll try to be stealthy here. You think that's a way over? Yeah, I don't see any other way. I think that's going to be it. Okay. Looks like that's blocked. I bet you there's another way. Probably not, but extraction arrived at another base. Yeah, it looks like there's not gonna be another way. Alright. Yeah, because we're already too far. All right, so we'll have to make uh, make do with what we got. I don't think we can get all the way up here. Oh, we can. Nice. Always got to search for these things. You never know what you can find. All right, so now we got the high ground. Got a B. Analysis complete. And a B. Don't see anything inside that tent, so we'll just let them go. We don't need B's, we want A's. There's a lot of erosion in that tunnel. Could come down any minute. Watch your step. 
It doesn't look like there's any enemies here. <coughs> that deep? Arrived I remember that cutscene from the uh, from the trailers. Holy shit!
And you must sign it, or ban it out. No go break here, bun. Well, that is actually trickier than you could possibly imagine. So you need to get him pretty much right there. Uh, that's the quickest way to take him out. There's also other things that you can do. Um, the other things that you can do is you see, of course, the, the towers. So trying to get him in the right location is kind of difficult. Uh, you, you need actually advanced weaponry in order to do all that. Um, however, just get him as close to this as you can, at least on that side, so he'll run into the water, and then you'll take care of him. Uh, if you don't get him that way, you can always shoot uh, Psycho Mantis or whoever it is, and uh, you can actually try to extract him, which is uh, another cool thing. Let's just go ahead and take this vehicle. So again, there's many, uh, any ways to do that, you can see all the, the water stuff. I guess that water pistol that we're developing now, you could probably use that as well. So this was a pretty cool mission, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, pretty much simple all the way up to you get to the end. You just got to get him uh, located right somewhere around in there. You can take him out really easily, or just you know get him near the water towers. Extraction arrived at Mother. It might take you a few tries, definitely. Development few retries. project has been added. And we got an Amazing. Achievement. Mission complete. That right there is why you're the best, boss. The one and only. All right. Code name Foxhound. So thank you guys uh, for watching. Of course, if there's any cinemas after this, we'll let them play. But uh, thank you so much. And hopefully you guys enjoyed. Again, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next mission. Peace out. Bitches. in Africa after all. Working behind the scenes, even that man on fire at his beck and call. But what the hell was going on at the devil's house? Earphones embedded in people's throats, tapes playing voices, and those lumps on their chests. They looked like the ones on the bodies of the oil field. 
The man on fire burned everything to the ground. But we were recording audio the whole time you were there. We'll conduct a thorough analysis of it.